seems like that uh, he kind of makes his own rules for the racetracks. You know, he pretty much calls the promoters and tells them what he wants to run in his car. He got to take him down. He's always complaining about people trying to claw at him and bring him down because he's at the top. That's what you're supposed to do. That's what sports are for. If there wasn't a number one person, there wasn't a win, people wouldn't be trying to come at you. I'm sure everybody's on the verge of bending the rules. I mean, that's part of racing. You always have to find the gray area. I don't know what else. I mean, you hear this all the time when you start putting wins together and doing good. Brett Hearn does it. Danny Johnson does it. It's just, this is something we've done all our life. You know, you get on a good roll and you and you don't miss nothing. Root turns three and four, racing. Tim Abgar with a lot of bite off of turn four, driving it into the lead now. And he's got the left front wheel hiked off the ground and leads him down the back. The book's already. Rocco and Bonnie a sixth, and Tad Cox with Osmond Pouch and Blue at the top ten. Made exactly the same Pouch challenging Osmond in turn number three. To Apgar now tries to put two wheels under him. Now he pulls alongside Apgar and Stangle closer this time. It's Apgar by a wheel. Nine laps in the book. Stangle completes the pass in turn two as he takes the lead. Down the front they come at Stangle and Butler. Apgar fifth, Ryan go down is sixth, Osmond is seventh. Pouch under Tad Cox sliding into the third spot now as they complete lap 14. Oh, Stangle and Butler get tangled together. Look out. Pouch to the high side. Whoa, gets a great run through one and two and rockets around Butler and into the lead. Coming out of turn number two, Rocco and Bonnie and Danny Buck. Oh, look out, it is Jimmy Blewett backwards and getting banged around. I want to win the race on the track, not because it's disqualification. But I'm glad he got the clue, at least they're checking something.